week 9 of integral calculus uh, our topic is trigonometric substitution the third or the fourth uh, methods of integration okay. there are three types of substitution trigonometric substitution that we can use in solving or evaluating integrals okay for letter a when the integrand contains a squared minus u squared we have to use the substitution u is equal to a sine theta then b when the integrand contains u squared plus a squared use the substitution u equals a tangent theta then letter c when the integrand contains u squared minus a squared use the substitution u is equal to a second theta okay uh, let us consider this example one para mas madali natin maintindihan yung uh, topic natin okay we are required to evaluate integral of x dx divided by square root of 4 minus x squared okay uh, by inspection makikita natin na yung involved na integrand contains yung form na a squared minus u squared yan yung 4 minus x squared kaya yan where a is equal to 2 kaya 2 squared is 4 minus x squared u squared equals x squared okay then uh, anong substitution ang gagamitin natin you use a sin theta okay sa solution natin we have to use uh, u where u is equal to x x equals a sin theta or 2 sin theta then kasama natin sa substitute yung value ng dx mula rito dx is 2 cosine theta theta d theta kaya yung given na integrand is in, integral of x dx divided by square root of 4 minus x squared equals yung value ng x is 2 sine theta then yung value ng 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 dx is uh, 2 cosine theta d theta divided by square root of uh, 4 minus x squared ang x squared is 4 sine theta squared kaya uh, 2 times 2 is 4 labas natin yung constant then we have uh, sine theta cosine theta d theta divided by square root of pag pinactor out natin yung 4 ma, magkakaroon ng value rito na 4 times quantity 1 minus uh, sine theta squared where 1 minus sine theta squared is equal to cosine theta squared yung square root ng 4 ay 2 then square root of uh, cosine theta squared this is equal to cosine theta magka-cancel siya rito 
Kaya, this is now equal to 2 times ang matitira na lang ay sin theta d theta kasi magka-cancel na yung uh, cosine theta at yung square root ng cosine theta squared is cosine theta rin yan kaya meron na tayong formula para dito which is equal to negative 2 uh, cosine cosine theta d theta, uh, d theta plus c Okay. Pero hindi pa dyan natatapos yung solution dahil kailangan natin ibalik yung original variable na x. Okay. Mula sa mula sa, sa substitution na ginamit natin na yung value ng x equals uh, 2 sin theta. Okay. Makita natin na yung sin theta is equal to x over 2 okay kailangan nating i-drawing yung triangle mula dun sa given sa right triangle kung ito yung angle theta yung definition natin ng sin theta is opposite over hypotenuse yan ang hypotenuse natin ay ito yung opposite side yung ay x mula sa definition na ito. Okay, at itong adjacent side ay equal sa 4 minus square root of 4 minus x squared. Kaya mula diyan, masasolve natin yung cosine theta which is equal to adjacent side over hypotenuse kaya square root of 4 minus x squared divided by 2. Kaya mula dun sa sa sagot natin integral of uh, x dx divided by square root of 4 minus x squared equal yan sa uh, sa 2 negative 2 cosine theta plus c kaya negative 2 cosine is square root of 4 minus x squared divided by 2 Yan yung value ng cosine theta plus c. Magka-cancel na ito. Kaya matitira. Yan yung final answer natin. It's negative 4 minus x squared plus c. Okay. Kaya yung sagot natin. Okay. That is solution uh, using trigonometric substitution okay. kung babalikan natin yung mga nauna nating solution para ma-check natin yung solution natin using trigonometric substitution etong form na ito pwede nating uh, integrand na yan ay pwede nating ilagay sa form uh, since ang square root ay ay raised to 1 half na exponent that is 4 minus x squared dahil itataas natin that is negative 1 half okay multiplied by x dx okay by trigonometric substitution uh, by substitution method na ginawa natin sa una Integration by substitution, ang value ng u dito is 4 minus x squared. At ang du ay negative 2x times dx. Kasi mayroon ditong x, ang gagawin lang natin ay mag-enter mag lang tayo ng negative na value, negative 2 para maging du yun pero in neutralize naman natin negative 1 na okay kaya okay. 
by substitution, ito ay u raised to negative 1 half, then du. Nang solution is u raised to negative 1 half plus 1 or 1 half over 1 half plus c. Magka-cancel itong 1 half dito, matitira u raised to 1 half which is equal to square root of of uh, u sorry negative square root of u is 4 minus x squared ok na parehas din sa naging solution natin using uh, trigonometric substitution okay. parehas lang Okay, mas applicable yung trigonometric substitution kapag wala ka na talagang uh, mak makitang ibang solution doon sa given na integrand. Okay? Uh, kung solvable naman siya using other methods aside from trigonometric substitution, yun na lang yung mas piliin natin. Ito, gaya na ito. Kaya naman siyang isolve ng uh, substitution method din naman okay. integration by substitution but then power formula lang yung in-apply okay. halimbawa dun sa original walang value ng walang value ng x dito hindi natin hindi na natin ito masasolve using uh, sim, simple uh, power formula okay. kaya obligado tayong gamitin yung trigonometric substitution